everybody. Lauren and I are back for more Nancy and, and my dinner. Because <laughs> that's how it works on this channel. Mm hmm. If it makes you feel better, I ought to meet dinner while we cook too. Right, Lauren can kind of mute herself and make it a little bit more sneaky. Okay. Where are my notes for this one? I don't know where my notes are. I can't find them in my notebook. So, do you remember what we were doing? We had, cho oh, we have to do the thing again, right? We have to earn pennies. Oh, the mouse. We have to, the mice. Yes. So we need to go out to the barn, do the little circuit board puzzles until we get 95. <clears throat> okay, I remember. Okay. Uh, okay, I'll take it. Three, four. I always feel like I have to check my work and I don't necessarily have to do that. Okay, so one, two, three, four, probably. One, two, three, four. <clears throat> okay, one, two, three, four, two, Probably this. I like these. They're not so bad. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Okay, how many That's did that earn us? Nice job, Nancy. Go take what you oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm. So we just need to go buy cheese, right? Oh, yeah, not accidentally eat it. Okay. Perfect. Okay, they're where are the mice now? They're downstairs. I think. Down here. Okay, so we put the cage down. Then we do this. Got it. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh no, little mice found. Yeah, this is a lot, a lot of mice for sure. room for one more here. to go that way and I want this one to turn there we go
them. Don't worry, fellas. You're gonna like your new home. Okay. I think so. Um, hold on one second. Um, Kath, thank you for letting me know. She was telling me that your um, volume is pretty low. Can you talk for me? All right, is that is that better? Can we hear Lauren better now? I hope so. Let me know. I know I can. I still can't hear her. I don't know. Okay. Talk for me. Still nothing. Oh no. Oh shit. Okay. Have her boosted. Let me boost her in Discord as well. If it turns out that I cannot be heard and we need to like travel through the app to the screen, that's totally cool. I'll just like not say a whole lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But I will be here for the journey. All right. Well, hopefully that's better. We'll do what we can. Deal is. I appreciate it though, Kath. Thank you. Where were we supposed to do that? Oh, like the little house. That's right. I was thinking, like, when we release the prairie dogs. But okay, we want the GPS for this one, and we want to go, yeah, spring house. So up, over, up, over. That's pretty easy. nice go be free perfect pardon pardon <laughs> sorry sorry okay um I guess we'll go talk to him. Oh, Weren't we getting rid of the mice for him? <laughs> he doesn't have anything to say.
Listen, buddy. We didn't solve that puzzle, that stupid number puzzle that took forever. For nothing, pal. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hold on. Kendall saying that my audio capture must be the issue. I'm going to boost the game volume as well. I'll check back with you in a bit. Have fun. Okay, good. Hopefully that helps with both, but we'll see. Mm hmm I'm just talking to people as well, but Guess I'll get going. Fine by me. Doesn't really seem like anybody's got much to say. Hmm. Nope. He said it was upstairs, right? Oh, here. This seems very obvious. I mean, are we supposed to do anything else with it to like troubleshoot it? All it does is open and shut it. <clears throat> what am I missing? I've read those. Do you know anything One of the about cameras? I want you to do today is track the mice I keep seeing by the table and get them out of here. <laughs> I think get pretty annoying. <clears throat> I better get to work. Have fun. Okay. I don't understand about the camera. Can I talk to you about it now? Yes. No. Yes, I'll get going. Whatever. Okay, talk. Should we try and talk to Frosty about it? Yo, you're a liar. So, what's up? No. I'll catch you later. Take care. Hmm. I mean, do we just move on? Guess so. Guess you can't prove anything. Yeah, I that's probably guess the issue.
All but one of them. Okay. Oh yeah, pennies. Yep. Yeah. Uh, for now. Good work. Go ahead and help yourself to your earnings. Perfect. Okay. Off to get more cheese. some toothpaste. Mice love toothpaste. Okay. And back again. <laughs> I'll just scoot around you on the not road part of the road. Here we go. Puzzle takes. It's not very hard. Like it all. It takes a while. Yep, yeah, for sure. I may have fucked this one up already. Oh, whoops. No, I don't want you. Go back there. There we go. stuck down there and then we can get this one to come down yeah it just takes a while <laughs>
have lights back. <laughs> yes. Pest world. I know pest world, but for kids. I suppose if no one can hear me, this isn't very fun. But <laughs> hopefully, they can hear you a little better now. Mice can squeeze through spaces as small as a dime. It's pretty small. I didn't know that. They eat between fifteen and twenty times a day. Animals after my own heart. <laughs> yep. Ooh, gosh. Okay, I don't like this one. They produce between 40 and 100 droppings per day. 40 droppings a day? To up to 100. That's a lot. That is, right. that is a good many. Oh, this is interesting. In captivity, they can live up to two years. Their lifespan is only five months. Hmm. Yeah. That's sad, but I guess that's how that's how a lot of animals are, I suppose. Very quickly. And they can have babies six to ten times a year. <sighs> I guess that's why they're pests. Because <laughs> they just keep making mice. Oh my god. I can't fathom doing that one time in my whole life. But, right. <laughs> mice are like, psh. A casual, like, 40 times a year. Or 40, or, yeah. Okay, you go up. Yep. They're nocturnal? Yeah. Mm. Aw, they prefer quiet places. Fair. I said that's fair. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I think I've... I think we're full up on mice. I don't know how she says that. And there's no mice in there. We just caught like 20 <laughs> mice. <laughs> the game's just like, ah. You don't need to see wait, them. Wait. <laughs> oh. I think if you leave without taking it, it makes you start over. Oh my god. No, no, no. Excuse you. That was their fault. <laughs> I'm not mad about the fact that this game has just turned into like a mice catch and release program <laughs> sort of simulator. Oh god, I've messed up somehow. Okay, it's this way. <laughs> okay, everything's fine. Toyota Priuses can handle anything. What's up? 
I think you guys what? have got a mouse problem. Yes, Nancy. No, we've got a mice problem, which we're all just trying to ignore because there's really no time to do anything about it. I think what? maybe the little piles of corn I keep finding are what's causing what? it. I haven't noticed what? any little piles of corn. Little piles of dirt. Ma'am? Corn? Anyway, it's more likely the mice are causing the piles. Probably storing up for the winter or something. What? This should have happened. I better get to work. Mm -hmm. <laughs> have fun. And we have sense taking care of it. Also, how do you not see the piles of corn? I feel like we talked to her about the piles of corn because she was like, I think somebody's feeding them. What's up? Nope. Thanks for all the advice. See ya. Maybe you could talk to the guy out in the garage. Yeah, nobody else has anything to say. Yeah. Sir, what's going on? Hey there. Nope. I'll check back with you later. Adios. Adios. I mean, sure. Close enough, as they say. Yes. What? Yes, I'll get going. Fine by me. Uh, okay. What do we have? We do have things we've never used. Um, oh, we have a money box. Why do we have a money box? Can we talk to somebody about the Back money already? box? You know. Just forget it. Maybe we Bye. Call? Mm. Or call, we could call our employer. I don't think we've ever done that. No, I don't think we have. Let's try that. Mm, phone numbers. Really? It might could wait, open up the phone. And then do the arrow. Oh, okay. PG Krollmeister. This can wait till I'm sure no one's listening. Okay. All right. Oh my god, Nancy. She's so Nancy, good to hear from you. <laughs> I've been watching the weather. Things look like they've been pretty rough out there. Glad to hear you made it through okay. <laughs> it was pretty intense. We would have gotten some great <laughs> data, but like I was not disappointed by his voice. Mm. I was wondering, why are you so concerned about tornadoes? You must have a lot of other things to worry about. Truth is, I never have been one to worry, but darn if these storms don't have my socks twisted in a bunch, something serious. See, Andy. <laughs> Most things in the world can be tamed, or at least tricked into behaving the way you want. Not weather. Ever since a tornado tore through my home, I've been obsessed with figuring out what makes those twisters tick. Pretty sure I built the machinery to do the job. That's why I need you to make sure nothing too funny is going on. Once I know I've made sure that no one else is ever caught off guard by a storm again, then I can move on to the next project. Until then, I just can't. I didn't know you got hit by a twister. Was everyone okay? Prudence Rutherford, uh, she's the one who oh my God. I hire you, by the way, was over, and I'm afraid she took a pretty hard knock to the head when the storm came through so suddenly. Prudence Rutherford? Are you two friends? That is none of your business. Uh, but if you really need to know... Keep it together for two seconds. Oh. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, none of your business. <laughs> um, just out of curiosity, how many products do you make? Oh, mm -hmm. let me see now. Uh, uh Coalmeister particle accelerator, uh, Coalmeister salad cannon, uh, uh, Coalmeister, well, the whole line of salad dressings. And then there's a... Ah, uh, not a clue. A lot. Never took the time to count. Do you have a favorite salad? invention? 
Got a salad cannon. Concerned about these machines. Now, there's no such thing as something that is just a machine. Every Krollmeister product is a work of art. Uh huh. If you say so. If I say so, <laughs> not only do I say so, so do millions of Kroll Summers. Now, stop trying to poke the bear and start trying to solve the mystery. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you know why someone would want to lure mice into their house? Is this one of those sound of one tree clapping in the woods questions? Never was much good at those. No, someone actually seems to be luring mice into the house. Hmm. Sounds like you've got a reverse Pied Piper situation. What's that? Who knows? Just made it up. I'd keep an eye out for something like that, though. Right and guys. get a cat. Everybody's like, just get a cat. <laughs> Can you tell me anything about Brooke Tavanaugh? Now that's some good detective work. You want to make sure that we're not overlooking what's going on with the other team, am I right? That's right. Now, I don't know much about Brooke, except that she's pushing hard for that number one spot. Very ambitious and very smart. A woman with that kind of talent doesn't need to sabotage her competitors, but that doesn't mean that she wouldn't. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes. Hmm. Obviously. Right, it's not a real complicated concept, Any idea sir. Why Debbie would be turning down better jobs to stay at Canute? Andy, much as I love to help you with every small detail of your Oh, come on, people, that's not even ours. Uh, now, uh, what was I saying? Was I lecturing you or were we talking? Oh, you were definitely lecturing unnecessarily. Lecturing. All right then, let me continue. Never mind. I can't even work up a good lecture these days with this crew. What can I do for you, Andy? I've well, enjoyed talking to you. Helpful. Nope. We talked to him. Machines. That did not get us anywhere we wanted to be. Don't feel like Frank and Joe are going to do that either. No. But we do have stuff that we've never used. So we have... Uh, I don't know if it's in our inventory per se. What is this? Um, oh. Do we have to drive around to do these? They're I like... Okay. Let's do that. Um, so we want to go up, over, okay. down... We'll just do that first. Up, over, down. Oh, can I not pull off here? Um, oh, we didn't go up far enough. Okay, so right up right up excuse us excuse us so i think it's here yeah, and then over and down so like here heck okay um so we can go up left up up left up is it 
Do those count as anything? Thin wispy clouds. Hold on one second. <clears throat> Do you want to get in the chair? Yeah. <clears throat> we have a Papasan chair in the corner of my office and like is not brave enough to get into it on her own even though the chair doesn't move around but she thinks like you have to hold it still for her while she jumps in it <laughs> That's actually adorable. she's like it's gonna move or something i can't do it on my own <laughs> and all i do is like put my hand on the cushion and she's like okay it's safe <laughs> I don't know what this is. Is it? Wall is lowering section of clouds from a cumulonimbus base that is capable of spawning tornado. I don't think it's that. I don't. Sh I guess we can just take a picture. We don't have to upload it. Yeah. Okay. So now we want to go, let's go to this one next. So we want to go right up and then all the way until it ends. Is that my right? Right away? No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Wasn't that? All uh, right, so we want to go left and then down at the first opportunity, left down at the first opportunity. So like this, and then like this, something like that right here. All right, that's something. Those are some clouds. I'm just going to start taking photos and then we'll go upload them all and then we can do the rest based on what we're missing. All right, so left all the way down, left down. Left all the way down. <clears throat> yep. Okay. I think the worst that can happen is he'll be like, there's already that one in the computer. Yeah. All right. Down, right, down, all the way to the right. Doing, we do anything here? Seems like we should be able to. Uh, sure. Okay, so I'm gonna go west, south, all the way west. <laughs> and then north west north west okay and then up and over yeah Okay, we'll go upload what we've got and then see what that 
connected to our paper. Oops. Yes, I understand. Okay. Gallery camera download download okay okay they're all in there so what did that do okay so we got three more so maybe we try and sleep because maybe it needs to be a different day. Yeah, maybe. I'm trying to recall, like, literally leaving a spot and then driving right back to it and the spots were different. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, that might be the case. I mean, you can try to see. We'll see. Stuff to do. Okay. I can't turn in. Okay. Stuff to do. Then give me the turnaround arrow. All right. Go back out. All right. So north, east, south, east, south. North, east. South, east, south. I feel like we already have these. I feel like they're serious. So if we leave and go like drive around the block here. Yep. <laughs> Pardon us. Yeah, this Prius is built like a tank. Maybe each one only gives you a certain number of them. Yes. It's more believable. Okay, so east, south, or sorry, west, south, west, south. Was, uh... Ooh, I think it's over there. Okay, maybe. I don't know. We'll take a picture just in case. But I don't think we need that one. No, they each have two. And we already have one. We already have the other one from there? Yeah. Okay, so. All right, so south, east, south, east, north, east, east, uh, oops, east, north, oh, okay, pardon, I'm lost, okay, it's just down here. This is it's the same, right? Okay. Hmm. I wish we could just like any other GPS, like click on yeah. where we want to actually go. 
Um, okay, so we want to go all the way over to that one. So we want to go south and then so west, south, two streets north. West, south, one, two streets north. Okay, take the first one north until it turns. At any of these? That's the same too. Well, as far as other things go, if we go back to the house, up, over, up, over, down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nope. Um, okay, regarding what else we have here, in my phone, I have pictures of the storm weather symbols and then there's that big chart are we supposed to be doing something with that um i thought somebody asked us to do something let's see Mouse situations, corn piles are, I think someone's trying to lower mice, but why would you want to do that? A little more to chase than it's on the surface. What about clues? Saw someone sneaking around the living room. I'd never have seen it if lightning didn't flash. Severed coolant hose in the old intern's car. It doesn't look like the work of a mouse to me. Um, okay, well that didn't give us anything either. Hmm, I'm betting like we can't go to bed or anything. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Oh, somebody's host, a heartless sign. Um, thank you so much for the host. Welcome to the stream. Just trying to take pictures of some clouds. <laughs> Real excited. As one does. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, okay, I guess we'll go to this one first. Is it? It's down here? Oh, it's over. Ooh. Excuse us. There we go. Um, were you streaming? How are you? How was your stream? Let's see. All right. Um, so we have to zoom in with a camera here.
What are we? This all seems like the same thing. Yeah. That's so weird. Okay, that's the wind mount. All right, so up or up over down. Okay. Bonk. Excuse us, excuse us. All right, it's this way. Now what? Oh. Uh, it's nothing. <laughs> right, like what? What? It's just all blob. Yeah. Okay. Viewpoint. Okay. Let's just go, we're going to go to these ones down here just to see. Jesus. I feel like everybody drives so aggressively. And I am definitely not driving aggressively. What are all these little pullouts for if you can't pull out and look at clouds? Oop, that's not where we want to be. Okay, I learned several things. Number one, apparently you don't even need all of these to finish the game. Oh. So don't know how important it is. And number two, did we ever fix the antennas? The antennas? Was that something we were supposed to do? Okay, where is that? Okay. We'll go do that because I don't know what else to do and I feel like that's probably what we need to do to progress the game. I totally forgot that. Ooh. Me too. I think we looked for it at the farm and we couldn't find where to do it. The wind sure did a number. Ah, okay, here we go. Okay. Oh, I see, I see. Can we wrote Yup. Uh, this one looks like... This is really weird perspective. <laughs> Yeah, it is. Yeah, walk around it. Um, yeah, the perspective is very strange. So we just need to look for this shape that's missing from one of the spots. Is that it? No. <laughs> the game was like, you dumbass. <laughs> um, these curved ones might be a little easier. Okay, got one. Mm 
There's a small little... Oh no, Nancy! What? Ugh, that's so dumb. We're gonna put the pieces right next to the dr just drive away <laughs> button. This little triangle. This one? Yeah. Oh, here. I see. I see, I see. Here. Oh, nice. What's that? Oh, hello. Team probably dropped this. Okay, something's happening. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, shit, y'all. I can't actually. I can't leave. Do I need to take a picture? Okay, I was like, well, then leave, Nancy. That's not the right way back to the farm. What is going on here? Somebody must have programmed this thing to give faulty directions. Construction ahead of car. Error ahead. Turn error. Ain't that just the way, Nancy? Okay. Hello, everyone. Nobody's worried about anything. What's up? Super bad at your job. They're real bad at tracking tornadoes. <laughs> Thanks to that faulty GPS, I wound up in the middle of a violent thunderstorm on my way back from fixing the antenna. I know it sounds paranoid, but I think someone tampered with it. You sure you were operating it correctly? Positive. I'll have Chase take a look at it. What else is going on? I'll check back with you in a minute. Nothing, bit. apparently. Have fun. Nothing at all. Time to turn in, Nancy. So, what's up? I've harassed you enough. Okay. Bye now. I guess we're going to bed. We did it. Works for me. <laughs> Morning, Debbie. What's up? If I seem a little frantic, it's because there's a front moving in capable of producing a supercell, maybe even lots of supercells. So we're moving out ASAP. Everyone's already outside. You'll ride with Chase in the. 
Hello? Holy cow, that was the jack for Scott's phone. Forget what I was saying. You're gonna have to stay here and fix Scott's phone connection. Scott will freak if he comes back and his phone doesn't work. As soon as I finish entering these data, I am out of here. Go on, go fix that phone. Go! But how do I oh my fix gosh. the phone? I've never done anything like that. It probably just needs to be rewired. I've seen you work. I know you can figure this out for us. Well, tell us. Hey, thanks for the confidence. Yeah. But also, stop giving us things that we don't know how to do. Also, this is like on fire? Oh, okay. Uh, we need to go get on, Debbie, let's get going. On my way. I know, I was thinking we needed to go get an extinguisher or something. Okay, what... What's happening here? Do we just have to get them all... I guess so. Actually have a problem. Maybe. Nope, do. That should do it. There. That was satisfying. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sometimes. Sound. As long as you're making sure that everything looks right, you know what I'm talking about. Hey, I know what I'm doing. This headset must have some kind of wireless connection to his cell phone. Wonder who he's talking to. Congratulations! Any chance you can keep your act together so that the rest of the world doesn't also know what you're up to? No one suspects a thing, Brooke. Brooke? That's the name of the leader of that room. Oh, shit. Let's try to keep it that way. You worry about keeping up your part <laughs> of the deal. I've got everything and everyone under control out here. The whole, like, storm chaser rivalry, I didn't realize it was all so serious. Looks like I need a key. We have a key. Professor Scott Varnell. Dear Professor Varnell, the College Tenure Committee has completed their review of your case and forwarded their findings. It is my regret to inform you that you will not be awarded tenure or promoted to rank a full professor this year. The committee believed that your application did not meet the college standards. These standards, as outlined in Section 4, clearly state the requisites for tenure. While your teaching and knowledge of your field was considered adequate, serious concerns were raised about your publications record in regards to quality, frequency, and practical application. I must support the recommendation of the committee. If you wish to appeal, you may follow the procedures as outlined in Section 7 within seven business days upon receipt of this letter. You may reapply for tenure during the next school calendar year. Melvin Tidmore. Well, got him. That's certainly why he's pissy. Okay. Can we snoop it all? Nothing to snoop on. Oop. Is this something we need to take note of? I know these are place Some of them are numbered. Yeah. I'm just going to take pictures of all of them. Okay. Just in case it comes up, we'll have them. Okay, are we meant to go find them? Debbie. 
Yeah, let's do that. She seems like the least suspicious one to me, but maybe that's just how it's supposed to seem. Yeah. And we've tried to snoop on him before and there's nothing over here. Yeah. They're looking. I guess, yeah, go talk to... Go talk to who? Oh, Chase. I always forget that he exists because <laughs> he's like out in the barn. Oh, he's gone too. Ooh, looks, looks like so Chase weird. stepped in that oil puddle I saw by the sprinklers. Or are there other puddles of oil around here? Hmm. Is that significant? Oh, it's 25 pennies. Is there, okay, is there anything else to do or? I think we already read this, right? We did, yep. <clears throat> yeah. Just take his whole jar. I don't... I feel like we are... How... How do we know... Uh... Gotta be something. Hello. They seem happy. Okay. Uh. Try to make sure. Well. That we found everything. They went storm chasing without their fancy pantsy camera. Hmm. Is there anything down here that we missed? Yeah, there's this under here, which I feel like we have not used, but then why does it exist? I don't know. Okay, that we just haven't seen yet. story about Ma. We read that. Okay. We've definitely looked at that. We fixed this just now. Was it any, was it something in this drawer? Okay, I was gonna say the only other thing.
at this? Oh, I thought it was still the radio. Coolant? Because <gasps> the, um, the coolant tube was cut in the car. And, and they were all like, it's sabotage! Yeah, I... Hello? Yeah, we're all fine. Great. I was hoping so, but after some Nancy, yeah. <laughs> everybody's fine. Something's come up, and I can really use you down the store. Please hurry. Okay, I'll be right there. We're coming, Pa. This is definitely not a trap or anything. I'm not. I don't know. Here, I don't know. The mouse trap. Good. Cause I've been seeing a lot of mice lately, especially by that homesteader display in the museum. I was having a nest right beside it. I want you to catch them for me and get them out of here before the oh health department hears about it. They give me a How many time times? Them I can do that for you, sure. That spit here. Is one of the moon. Oh, thank God. thank God. Ooh, I'll need that. Thanks. I was gonna say, that would have been real shitty if we're like doing him a favor and he's like, I will not supply you the cheese. Uh, he, it was over here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No? Why would we be able to there might have been something on the floor there, something to start with. What? Why can't we put the mat the trap down? Um, dust bowl, I think, yeah, this one. Okay, maybe it's here. There we go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It's this one. I mean, I couldn't, yeah. Okay, there we go. All right, little mice. Let's do this thing. All right. Okay, let me. <laughs> uh, what do I That one's full. That one's full. Okay, let's block that guy. cool I guess <laughs> no go over there Okay, those three are stuck. A kangaroo rat can go a 10 year lifespan without any water. What? That's crazy. Seems impossible. They must get it from their food. Hmm. 
guess if they're readily available. They make um, many, many baby mice, so... That's fun. <laughs> <laughs> to like make it accurate. Oh my god, they had pet rats. That is pretty cute, actually. Okay, let's send you down. Not that way. Here we go. Sure, there's a super efficient way to do this that I'm not doing it that way. You're doing great. <laughs> I'm doing it in a very like it'll get done eventually kind of way. <laughs> mind this puzzle it's just time consuming more than anything else The, uh, I think it was National Geographic did like a, a photography series on New York City, like sewer rats. Oh, really? Um, and I think it was meant to be like, oh, look at these sewer rats. But the, all the pictures, I was like, they're so cute. What are you talking about? Like their little faces. I was just like, I don't see the problem. <laughs> I'm not a New Yorker. I know they're kind of like a whole thing, but. I thought they were quite cute. Jesus. That's pretty, that's pretty insane. I'm finished here. Thank you, Dad. You did it. Thanks for catching that mice, Nancy. Of course, of course. Ah, oh, somebody redeemed Stretch. Hell yeah. 
thank you for the reminder. I will gladly. Oh. Somebody needs to redeem, buy Hannah a massage so I can have somebody deep, <laughs> deeply massage my calf muscles for a full hour. Please. <laughs> Uh, okay, so now that we're back at the farmhouse, I know how to get to the place. At least I think I do. No, I don't. No, I don't. I messed it up. Oh. All right, so. I have to check the GPS. It's... Shoot, I don't remember. Spring house. Okay, so over, up, over. Got it, got it, got it, got it. That wasn't there before. That's the divining rod that's missing from the museum. <gasps> I wonder if someone was trying to hide it. And stepped in that pool of oil over there in the process. Oh, shit. I feel like you could just make a fake defining rod. Or is that what he said he would do? Maybe that's what he said he would do. That for sure looked like a giant tornado in the background. No big deal. I'm sure it's fine. I don't ever know where I'm going. Oh, here's the field, so it's... Sorry! <laughs> oh, it's this way. Well, we're going to pause. Well, I guess we could talk to him first if we could. Oh, yeah, I was just... going to confront him, but we should probably do Pa first. I found your missing divining rod. Well, put the cat out of the rain. Where was it? Out in the spring house. <laughs> if you can put it back in the display, I'd be truly grateful. Sure. I'll let you get back to work. Stop by anytime. Okay, it was the gold rush one. This one? No. Where does it go? This it go here somewhere? Oh, right. Well, wow, if it ain't my favorite customer, I returned the rod to the display for you. Oh, okay, thank you. Actually, you deserve more. Oh, okay. I was like, oh my gosh. I feel like a small child, an adult, just being like, hey. Good job, here's a dollar. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to him. We're on to you, pal. Hey How was the chase that I missed? I went pretty good. Didn't see any funnel clouds, but I managed to plant a sensor right in the path of a major downdraft. If you can believe that. Was Scott there to see it? He went in the base vehicle by himself. But he was real happy when he heard about that sensor. Yes, ma'am. Mm-hmm. Did you fix the GPS devices? Sure did. I think maybe they could use some more work. Mine went berserk and tried to lead me directly into the path of a storm. Did it what now? It tried to lead me right into the storm. I'm real sorry, Nancy. All I did was run a few updates and... I'm very sorry, it went haywire on you. 
I'll make sure it never happens again. What's weird is that mechanic, like, it driving it had never given us vocal directions before, and then suddenly the game was like, you're supposed to listen to these, and I was like, uh, yeah. no. You've been spending all your spare time around here trying to find oil, haven't you? Oil? Well, I've been doing no such thing. Where'd you get an idea like that? Um... I found the divining rod you took from Pa's museum. The one you left by the old spring house. I should have known I wouldn't get away with it. Lying and conning and sneaking around. They just don't come natural to me. My mama raised me just too right. <laughs> See, I heard rumors there was an oil deposit somewhere We're underneath this here farm. I also heard the cars were getting ready to dump the place. So I signed up with Scott, figuring I could look for oil. And if I found some, try to get my daddy to invest in a little real estate. Hmm. And to make sure Canute dumps the place, you've been sabotaging the chase team. You think I'm the one making everything go wrong? Well, you wrong about that. It's on account of Scott. He's the one messing stuff up around here. He's a jinx. And that's the truth. Listen, I'm truly ashamed of my behavior, Nancy. I will apologize to Pa for taking that divine rod first chance I get. And I know it's highly unlikely, but should you and my mama ever cross paths, I'll keep this to myself, but you've got to keep being honest with me. You got a deal. You know, come to think of it, I guess I can't rightly say all the bad stuff that's been going on is just bad luck. Like when I checked out the lightning rod on the farmhouse to see why Scott's phone blew up like that, I discovered something kind of strange. Or do tell. Instead of being wired to any lightning that struck the house to be directed to the ground, this here lightning rod connected to the wire inside the house. Someone wanted that phone jack to explode? Or the TV, or the fridge. Someone just wanted to do some damage. But you're sure it was wired that way on purpose? Either that, or this thing was put up by the world's dumbest electrician. Hmm. That's it for now. See you around. want to talk to Scott. Hello, Nancy. I heard someone talking about some Rook person. Who is she again? Nancy, Rook Tavanaugh. She heads oh, yeah. the She's like, um, who's Brook like again? <laughs> the competition. Does she deserve to win? I, I don't know. Look, if it's all the same to you, I just assume talk about something else, okay? Mm, okay. I'll quit bugging you now. Whatever. Whatever. Hey, thanks for fixing the phone. You didn't miss much on the chase. Well, I'm sorry you didn't get good weather. Well, that's the brakes. Hey, you know, since you're so good at fixing things, why don't you fix the TV? I think we've abused it enough. It's not getting any picture. <sighs> okay. I'll check back with you in a bit. <laughs> Have fun. Nancy's such a patient person. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Right. Okay, so if we... Are we like... Oh, I see. So red. Yeah, I think he's gonna make it so all of them match. All of the ones on here match, right? Cause like there's not. Right, like there's more on there than there are. On here, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that can't be it because it needs to be blue red wait it's saying it needs to be green and red there no i think you do them one at a time oh just one color at a time yeah 
Okay, so it needs to be blue, blue, blue. Okay, so that one looks good. So is this the next circle? No. We'll just do this one next. So this is, so it needs to be blue in the middle there, blue in the middle there, blue on the right. I think that works. Okay. Then, okay, this is the middle, so there, there. Okay. Very center. Yeah, that one works. Was that this one? No. I think the only one you've left is the bottom. Okay. Which is the third one, so we need a blue right here. And a blue... There. Okay. Nothing happened. No. Not very well. <laughs> um, Does it have to be red first? Maybe. Maybe so. Okay, we'll do red. Um, so it needs to be a red in the center there, a red on the right there, and a red on the right there. Okay, that works. And then that needs to be red, red in the center there, or no, so this is the second ring. So that needs to be red, that needs to be red, and that needs to be red, okay. Red, red, <clears throat> red, okay, center, red, red, okay, and then, okay. Okay. So presumably now we can do green. So green there, green there. Green there. There, not there. There, 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 there. Okay. Next is second. So there needs to be green in the top left middle. And then there. Okay. Uh, right, right there, right there, nope, right there, there, nope, okay, there,
Okay, blue. What am I doing wrong? Oh, I was looking at it totally wrong. Oh my god. Okay. Oops. Um, okay, so blue there, blue there, and blue there. Good. Alright. Second from the middle, that. 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 Nope. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Outer ring, blue there, blue there, blue there. Okay. Uh oh. Is one of the other rings wrong? Okay, let's check it. So we have blue here. I don't know which knob that is, though. Oh, well, th but that's the one that I'm turning. And I'm going all the way around on it. So one of the other ones has to be wrong. I'll get this one where it needs to be, if you can check the other ones. Okay, that is good. Okay, that's not right. That's good. Nope. Nope. Yep. Okay, that's where the third one needs to be. What are we missing? Okay, this. <clears throat> that's right. That's right. That's right. Okay, that's right. That's right. That's right. Oh, it's the um, center one. Is that. Is that this one? Okay. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Oh shit. It did record after all. Got him. I think it's a lost cause, Nancy. It's permanently broke. Bummer. Well, we saw just enough. Uh frosty. This is the part of Nancy's job I would be really bad at. <laughs> Nancy, whoa, never seen that look on your face before. You've been secretly selling tornado footage to someone, haven't you? Uh, what? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> You've been shooting stuff for the team, but selling it on the sly, using the box under the yellow rose bush by the barn as a drop point. That's how you got all those scratches on your arm. And Debbie not only knows about it, she condones it. I overheard you two talking out in the cornfield. Or should I say, conspiring. 
You two are trying to get Scott so frustrated that he finally blows, and says or does something that will force the college to let him go. Nancy, do you have any idea how crazy you sound? What I don't know for sure is whether you two are also responsible for the other stuff that's happened around here, like the hose in Pete's car, and the equipment failure, and the mouse infestation. Guess I'll just have to tell Scott everything and see what he thinks. Okay, look, no. <laughs> I don't know why you feel like you need to stick your big fat nose where it doesn't belong, but all I did was sell some pictures and footage to this girl I know who's trying to make a name for herself as a nature photographer. Legally, all the stuff I shoot belongs to the team, but that's totally unfair, and Debbie agrees. She knows how hard it is to get a good start, and she looks the other way. Don't be upset with her, though. She's just trying to help. But when it comes to all that other stuff, I had nothing to do with any of it, and neither did she. I promise you. So there's really no reason to tell Scott any of this. Right? I guess not. You're a fine lady. Oh, and that big fat nose thing Fitting. <laughs> so the only person left so, uh, that how are those cloud really pictures coming Scott. actually mm -hmm. the problems finding zero stratus you know if you head on out to the Fraser Creek windmill I'll bet you anything you'll get your picture weather conditions for zero stratus should be perfect right now in the meantime I got to get back to work see ya do we have to do that or is it just a like if you want to get them all, it's probably an achievement. It is, I think. I'm not here for achievements. Time to turn in, Nancy. Ah, crap. What's going on? Hmm. Guess I'll get going. Fine by me. Okay. What will happen on, today? Daddy. Nancy, perfect timing. We've got a couple target storms ready to go critical. We need to get out in the field now. You'll drive. Scott and I are going to be tracking the storm. Okay? Ready? Yes. Let's go. Okie dokie. Apparently. We've got two, maybe three possible targets out there. All right. Good. That's what I like to hear. Tell me what we're looking at. Got word that the northmost cell is already throwing some pretty sizable hail. We might be a little late on that one. All right, that's not the system. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Did you see that shit? We just got bumped back in. <laughs> All right, that's not the system. I'm excited about anyway. That's like so. We go west. It's a long drive, but there's some good movement and high amount of shear. Perfect. From what I've been hearing, Brooks' team has been saying they already got six confirmed touchdowns and two good reads on supercells that didn't spawn fun. To the clouds? Yeah. But it's... Okay. Maybe she'll share what she's got. Huh. Now that's an idea. Why didn't I think of that? Brooke, it'd be really cool if you'd share your data. I mean, Move it's it. just the polite thing to do. All right, stay sharp. This system is starting to look really good. Should I drive into one of the pull-offs for tracking the storm? Yes. Okay, well, give me a moment. Look at that. There is nothing for miles. It's your lucky day, Nancy. I don't feel like wrestling with the prehistoric Doppler. You're going to do it for me. Okay. Um. Uh, this. Since can you care okay. less about providing working equipment than stuck with this garbage? You're going to have to take care of warming it up since it's about twice your age. We're going to have to flip three switches, one in each group, to get it started. All the lights need to be set to blue before it starts working properly. Remember. The lights won't turn until you activate them. Okay. What? What? I, what? <laughs> he wants them all blue? Yeah. What does this say? Clues? Oh, God. I'm pretty sure he said one in each group, 
and I can only switch three, but they all need to be blue? Yeah. How is that a thing? What? I mean, because we can just... There, I did it. What? I don't... Can you explain? <laughs> yeah, if just I just need to hear the rules again, but for whatever reason she didn't um What? <laughs> so he said that you have to flip ones in a different group. So yeah. So if you like did one of those, and then one in the middle, and then one on the right. Yeah. So flip the green button. So then do one of those, and then make one of those yellow. Oh, I see. Okay. The game really expected you to totally understand that from him saying it one time. Gotta get this back up and running quickly. If those cables get mixed up, it will be days before I can get them resorted. Okay. Huh? Oh. Make sure you keep those cables in order. Don't forget the top cable goes in the first plug and the bottom goes in the last plug. Oh my god, this is like pick up sticks. Ah. <laughs> yeah, okay. Pink's definitely on top. So green is under pink and yellow, so it's not so it was any yellow, blue, so this blue is next. Can you hurry it up a little? No. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> it's All right. in yellow, I guess. Yeah, so yellow. And then green, yeah. lime, I should say. <clears throat> All right, orange is. Almost done. Oh, what my this that's gonna get annoying. Yeah. All right, blues under purple, which is under lime, which we've already done, which is under light blue, which is under. So light blue. Light blue yeah. Um, Maleksinator has raided us with a party of two. Thank you so much. Welcome, guys. How are you doing? How are things coming on that Doppler? That like live thing. Okay. Sorry, I was looking at streaming stuff. <laughs> um, how was your stream, Maleksinator? You were saying this lilac one? No, the, uh, like, paler purple. This one? Yeah. Lime, light blue, that blue. Yeah, that looks right. Um... All right, purple is under light pink, which is under that and that, so I think pink. And then purple. 
purple. So I'm do that and that and that and that and that. So. Okay. Hurry it up a little. Oh wait, no, it's. I don't know about that one yet. Haven't played Trail of the Twister yet. My stream went well. We were also solving puzzles yet. Yeah, well, this one's very puzzle heavy. So <laughs> yeah. puzzles and chores. So many puzzles and chores. Um, okay, what Make about... Make sure you're keeping those cables in order. Try working from the top down. These people talking oh. is so freaking doing? annoying. Okay. Orange, lime, purple, dark, dark purple. Okay, so dark purple, so then orange, lime, purple, dark purple, yellow, hot pink, and lilac, so blue. How are things coming on that Doppler? What about this one? Pink and orange, teal and yellow, light blue, okay, red, green is over red. Oh my god, I'm literally- how- what do you want from me? What do you want from me? Nice job, Nancy. Looks like we're ready to roll. Okay. I don't mind puzzles like that. Like that one's fine. Nothing's developing like it should be. Let's get back to base and track from there. I don't want to follow a bum lead on a system with this much potential. Okie dokie. I'm just going to do just a little cheeky save. Yes. Might as well. It's been a while. Yeah. Don't want to lose everything. Nancy, have you seen Scott? Not since we got back. There's a huge front coming in and he's nowhere to be seen. This is not like Scott. If you see him around, will you let me know? Chase and Frosty and I are supposed to be leaving for the Grange soon. And I really need to know that someone is keeping an eye on these fronts. Okay. I mean, watch him just be sitting in here. <laughs> no, he's not. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. What the? been paying Scott off? Oh, intrigue. Uh, <laughs> this is end game. Okay, yeah. Just in case you don't want spoilers, Malexinator, you might want to tap out. Uh, you fulfilled your end of the bargain. My team is bound to win now. Let's meet at the agreed upon location this afternoon before the storm hits. I'll bring your payment. Don't forget the final terms are you disappear until my team has officially been named the winner. Okay. Re review surface charts. Okay. Let me take a picture. All right. I'm alert. See you again soon. Toodles. <laughs> Thanks for saying hi. Okay. Take a picture of this. Is it that uh, chart thing that we have yet yeah, to use? In the book downstairs, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Is the calendar important at all, though? Because it says find dates. A, like, letter or number or something. Okay. So, so, with the calendar. So, yeah, the book's downstairs. Over here, this book. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Review surface chart. Okay, 45 and dew point and continuous moderate rain. 45. It says 45 plus dew point, so I don't know if that means for like the dew points over 45 and continuous moderate rain. That would make sense. 
I think that's what it wants. I'm working on it. Okay. Continuous moderate rain is the three circles. So a dew point with the three circles that's over. So it could be day eight. Perhaps. Or that dew point. It could be day 21. Or... They're all over 45, 26, I don't understand, 31 isn't, but is there like many pages of these? Oh my god, wait, what? Is there, on that note, was there like an and situation? Um, it says location site, um, let me just send this to you because it's easier. Um. But it, it's a little bit vague. It says 45 plus dew point and continuous moderate rain. And then the next one is like 85 degrees with either light hail, no thunder, or severe thunderstorm with hail. What? <laughs> Does it... Okay, so this is March. April 3rd. April 10th. Or April 29th. That's what I, I don't understand is how there's like m many of each. Okay, it's not in May. <laughs> so the first date is one of those six dates. The second one. All right, let me look for, so it's either light hail, no thunder, or severe thunderstorms with hail. That's what I did. I wrote day eight. I wrote March 8th, 21, 26, and then April 3rd, 10th, and 29th. Okay, yeah. And then um, I think, yeah, we need to write them all down. So can you read me the weather conditions for the second one? 85 degrees, exactly, <laughs> with either light hail. Okay, so the light hail, no thunder is this symbol. Let me go back to March. So let's just, I guess, look for 85 degrees temperature. So this one counts. So March 3rd. <clears throat> uh, 85. That is... Severe thunderstorm with hail, so that counts, yeah? Yep. Okay, and then is there any more 85s? No. All right, so April 6th. Um, no. That's not, that is severe thunderstorm rain only. That's something else. Okay, so I think it's just those three for the second one. Okay. All right, let's go look at the calendar and see if that makes any sense. <laughs> yeah, okay. Maybe it will, maybe it will be like, well, we've done something very wrong. Okay. Oh, yeah, you type in. Scott, you okay, so March 8th is M. March 21st, 
26th, and then April, oh, okay, so you want, like we do all the March ones first? Should we put them in numerical order or? Probably. Okay, so the third would be, it would be three. No, WM. Three, eight. Windmill? Maybe nine. Uh, A, G. Right, like it's. Well, let me see how. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine dates written written down. Yeah. So we've done something wrong. <laughs> <clears throat> we know we need 12 things, so that should help a little bit. Okay. 45 plus dew point. And it has to have that symbol. It says, the three symbols says moderate rain continuous, right? That's it's yeah. okay so yeah three dots 45 plus dew point so March 8th yes March 21st and March 26th but not the 31st and then I have for this one I have April 3rd April 10th and April 29th. Yep. Okay. For this one, I have none for May. All right. I keep hitting the microphone because it's right. Okay. Um, Eighty-five degrees. Oh my god, it's not eighty-five exactly. It's eighty-five plus. My bad. Eighty-five plus degrees. Oh, eighty-five plus. Oh, so anything higher than an eighty-five. Yeah. Got it. Okay, so maximum temperature. Well, I think it can be like a greater than. But eighty-five would need to be in the minimum slot, not in the maximum slot. Or is like it ha if it has to be eighty-five plus, or is it just? Huh. Okay, I guess we'll just write down any of the days it could be 85 or higher. So 85, so March 3rd, the, not the 17th, oh my gosh, so many Nancy raids tonight. Ice Cold Car has just raided with 20 people. Welcome everyone. We're looking at storm charts. <laughs> How's everybody doing tonight? Oh, thank you for the follow. Ice cold raid. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't mean to do that. I hit the wrong button. I was already here on another tab. <laughs> welcome, welcome everybody. Um, okay, so it's going really well. This is Trail of the Twister. Have you played this one? This is also very close 
end game. Yeah, if if you yeah, if you need a spoiler warning, this is like end game trail of the twister. <laughs> we finished Legend Legend of the Crystal Skull tonight. That's a good one. I do like that one. Mhm. Mm How did you like that uh that um was it Rube Goldberg the the like chain reaction puzzle with the shelves? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that puzzle was a little rough. Um okay, so the seventeenth does not count. I have the eighteenth written down and that's it for March. Okay, April. Anything higher? So the fifth no. The sixth, yes. Um, it's not the right symbol though. It's the same symbol as... No, that one's got a dot on the top. Uh... The one we want is that, but it has a triangle. Yeah. Uh... So, not that one. Six, yes. <laughs> um... The 21st, no. 22nd, no. 23rd, though, yes. Yeah, don't spoil it for you. I mean, you get these charts, I'm sure, are riveting. <laughs> but we will, we will be solving, I think, one of the, this is probably like the final puzzle, I would guess. Um, okay, so we have April 23rd, and then anything in May? No, okay, not the 5th. Okay, the 6th. So May 6th. May 12th. That's my birthday. Um, the 13th, no. 14th, 15th. I don't think any other ones. So it, how many is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Perfect. Okay. Off we go. Now we have to figure out how to potentially put them in an order. Do we just want to go by month? Cause like, cause like March and April both have five letters in them each, but May only has two. Okay. Yeah. So if we put Marches in order, it'll be W, oops, I don't know, W, M, nine and then a g okay april's are the third v the sixth two tenth c 23rd and 29th Four and A. Okay, so we have the spring house. What is GV? So windmill WM9A GV2C. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, that's got to be right then. <laughs> got to, got to. Okay. 
So what is GV? What is that? What do we do with these? <laughs> what are the other things though? Like we have sort of have locations. All right, so west, south, east, south. Pardon? Is this our turn? Nope. Whoa. Uh. Okay. Yeah, so like, what does the 9A mean here? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Should we talk to someone first? Okay, I, should we go to the spring house? Let's go to the spring house just to see. All right, up, over, up, over, up, over. Woo! Okay, this still works. Just need to take left here. Hmm. I f we must have to talk to somebody about it first. Yeah. How did she, like why did she not say anything about the response? I don't. I think you're totally right. Like, like, uh, yeah. Mhm. Mm Woo. Yeah, there's there there must be something we need to put together. What's going on? I thought you were supposed to be at the theater right now. Change in plans. Scott's gone, and we've got a major storm front moving in. Okay. <laughs> he left in the truck. Nancy. He's got all of our equipment, and he's not answering his phone. That makes sense. It does? Yes. I found a note in yes. Scott's office. He's been meeting with Brooke, and she's been paying him off to sabotage the team. That's where he is right now. What? No. Wait. I'm gonna have to deal with that later. It doesn't matter right now. What's important now is that we keep on top of this storm. With the way conditions are developing, this front could produce the strongest weather we've seen this season or ever. And I still don't know where it's headed. Today is quickly approaching nightmare status. I think I might be able to track the storm using our old methods, but this would be so much easier if we had our equipment up and working. You need the equipment? Consider it done. Wait, Nancy, that's not what I meant. You work on tracking the storm, and I'll work on tracking down Scott and the equipment. Nancy, hang on. At least make sure you stay in radio contact. And if things start to get bad out there, I want you to promise me you'll head to his shelter immediately. I promise. Okay. Well, we still don't know where we're going. I know. Is there going to be something on the GPS now? Should we just drive to the storms again, I guess? Oh my god. Sir? Because we don't know which storm cloud it is. Ooh. I don't know what we're supposed to do. Okay, down, over, down.
Oh my. Storm, but... Right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> uh, okay. Move it. No, I don't want to go this way. Oh my God. Move. <laughs> Don't you people know there's a tornado happening? I don't... Maybe the windmill? Because that's on our list. I, do, I really don't. I like suddenly don't know what to do. Oh, it looks chill here. There's a rainbow. <laughs> oh my god. Clues. Nope. Okay, maybe. Frost, frost. Cooler. Is he, is he even he's not even down here Will you wait? Go look at the computer. this one yeah and then um the gallery hmm those are the pictures we took right those are the ones that were there before um match yes. Scott's. Okay. This must be some sort of code. There we go. Yeah, I had seen it. Okay, yeah. Windmill is this one. It's Trixie. GV and WM. Okay. So does this one. Hmm. They're all the windmills. Yeah. Okay, game. We have been there like three times. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like, you could have just gave us that one. We just literally drove around the whole all town. The windmill. That must be where Scott's been meeting <laughs> Okay, all right, all right. Okay, all right. Now let's go to the windmill. Let's all go to the windmill. Let's all go to the windmill. <laughs> okay, where is that again? I don't remember. I can't ever keep them straight. So we are at the farmhouse. We want to go to the windmill. Okay. Tis that one. Ugh. Marr. I think it's this one. Nancy, what are you doing here? You mean me as opposed to Brooke? <laughs> what? When I was fixing the phone jack, I accidentally overheard the phone conversation you two had. I could hear it through the headset on your desk. And just what do you think you overheard? Enough to know you two are working together. You've been sabotaging your own team, haven't you? You've been doing everything you can to make sure Brooke's team wins and yours loses. That's ridiculous. That's why you're meeting her way out here. So the people who've been looking up to you all this time couldn't see her paying you off. I have never gotten the credit I deserve for the work <laughs> I've done, ever. I know more about tornadoes than any person alive, and I get neither the respect nor the compensation people half as brilliant as me get without lifting a finger. Why? Wow, you're humble, too. Because I work for a podunk college run by podunk incompetence bent on bad-mouthing and spiting me at every turn just because I don't play well with others at their idiotic staff meetings. Why don't you just quit? Because thanks to them, I'm considered impossible to work with. No other school will hire me. I'm stuck here and they know it. So <laughs> yes, I've been sabotaging my own team. And yes, Brooke is paying me a small fortune to do so because I've had it. 
I'm through. Oh, he mad. He big mad. Someone called the ambulance. Why they always got to take it to the next level? They do. They take it so far. Hello? This is Debbie calling for Nancy. Please come in. Over. Do we have a radio? Maybe in the car? <laughs> what? <laughs> when did we get a radio? I'm here. Oh, okay. I was like, this is something new. Never had a radio before. Selling the team out to Brooke. He went berserk. ASAP. We need to evacuate the theater, and you've got my Grange keys with you in Frosty's car. I'm on my way. Over and out. Where? The Grange? Oh, okay, good. <laughs> I was like, I don't know what that is. <laughs> okay, bottom left corner. Got it. I'll just do my best. I just love the visual of Nancy in her car, like Cruella de Vil style, like going to ham, trying to get. Oh my god. Nancy! Nancy! <laughs> we are not stuck right now. Okay. <laughs> Wait, is this not where we need to be? Oh my god, we're at the wrong exit. Shit, move it! <laughs> what is a Grange? Oh. It's been chaos here. I was able to cobble together a pretty basic tracking system back at the homestead, and instantly I knew we were in trouble. The storm was showing a high potential of moving into town, but without the proper readings, we couldn't issue an alert. I knew we'd have to evacuate the Grange in person. But when we got here, we saw that it's locked. The shelter is locked on a performance night. I need you to take care of this while the rest of us work on a backup plan, okay? Oh. Okay. There are a lot of people depending on you right now. Okay. I will definitely not get us killed. Wait, what? It's not like a puzzle? Oh, we have keys. I was like... What is this now? Who would double lock a storm shelter? Nancy, quick, which key opens the shelter? Lady. <laughs> okay. Wow. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. That's not really a puzzle. That's just like a pick the right one. Right. Yes, we'll try what again. Is this now? Who would double lock a storm shelter? Nancy, quick, which key opens the shelter? Yes, you did it. Nice job, Nancy. <laughs> Great job. Yeah, Nancy was just like, all right, bye. <laughs> just left everyone out there to die. Nancy, where are you going? Get in the shelter. I can't just let Scott get away. Yeah, it's not how we roll. Okay, Nancy, first thing, switch on your GPS. That little dot you see, follow that, and it will lead you right to Scott. We put a tracker on his truck. It's a safety thing. Uh huh. Not what it sounded like when I overheard you talking to Frosty. You two wanted to get rid of Scott. And from where I was standing, you sure didn't sound very concerned about safety. <laughs> Nancy, I know it probably sounds bad, but there's a lot you don't know. I like how there was so much urgency, and now they're like, His injury wasn't just an accident. He got hurt because Scott sent him out. No. Out there, 
promise me that you'll be careful. I promise. That was a real long conversation. Okay, yes. Okay, so... Okay, I Yeah. So we're just... He's just pointing to where he is, I guess? Oh, that's him. Oh. I thought that was just one of the other drivers that I run off the road any given day. Mmm, that was the wrong call. Maybe? What the? Where did he go? How did we come so close to catching him? <laughs> oh, hello! Oi! Nancy games love a car chase. They do. Or a snowmobile chase. <laughs> oh yeah, the snowmobile chase. That was a good one. I was what? I thought we did that too. I thought we successfully did that. <laughs> it made a noise and I had a I better find us some shelter. Okay. Okay. Dear Ned. Oh once the theater was successfully evacuated. Debbie and Chase were able to follow the GPS tracking signal to the spring house, where Scott and I had safely weathered the storm. Although he was pretty seriously shaken up in the crash, Scott came to in time to see Frosty arrive with the police. He received community service for destruction of public property and interfering with public safety records. He didn't fare so well with a the college. They fired him quicker than lightning hitting a beast on Greyhound, <laughs> as they say around here. So what? it looks like he'll actually be serving the community now. <laughs> Even if it's just by picking up garbage by the side of the road. Word spread quickly about Scott's misdeeds, and soon Brooke Tavanaugh, the rival chase team leader, found herself out of a job as well. With the storm season almost over, it looked like both teams were out of the competition. Debbie, always the organizer, decided to combine the remaining members oh, on both so teams for the remaining Way season. better. <laughs> Without Scott's ever-present storm cloud hanging over the team and his constant sabotaging, the team really began to hit its stride with Debbie in charge. Two days after I told Krollmeister I had found the source of the sabotage and the change in team leaders, Debbie's chase team was greeted by a surprise delivery, the next generation of Krollmeister's storm tracking and detection equipment. With Scott out of the picture, Frosty renegotiated his contract. Now that he's able to pursue his own projects on the side, he's just about doubled his output. He's launched his own business, and when he's not getting pelted by softball-sized hail, you'll find him in his studio. Chase has given up on his dreams of finding oil. Even if he hadn't, he wouldn't have the time to look. Debbie's keeping him too busy. Free from having to spend his days fixing Scott's mistakes, Chase has finally had the opportunity to show off his keen sense for weather. Now that Debbie has accepted Scott's old position as head of the Canute Storm Team, he's become her right-hand man. Last I heard, he was going to assist Debbie in her classes in the fall. And when I got home, I found a surprise delivery myself as well. The first <laughs> shipment of my lifetime supply of <laughs> Lifetime robots. supply. Meister also wow. sent me a note telling me to keep my bags packed. He has a special surprise trip planned for me as a way to say thanks. As long as it's some place where the clouds stay in the sky like they belong, I'll be happy to go. 
While the winners of the Green Skies event won't be determined until fall, things are looking pretty good for Debbie's team. With the new equipment, they've logged the most storm data. And although Debbie won't be showing anyone until she's 100% sure, the team may have made a verified touchdown prediction. Yesterday, a postcard from Pa arrived. After the town repaired the storm damage to the Grange, they restaged the town play. They even added a new part about the storm, including a scene where a certain someone unlocks the storm shelter. As long as it wasn't played by Pa in a wig, I'm happy. Pa said that he remembered most of his lines this time, at least the important ones. As for me, well, I've had just about enough stormy weather for one season. Love, Nancy. Oh boy. Where are we going next? Ooh, I don't know this. I also don't know this. Ooh. That was has been what I picked too. Sure. <laughs> Nice, nice. Huh. After risking my life chasing down deadly twists, <gasps> ooh, I'm excited. Join Bess and George on their trip to Kyoto, Japan. I've always wanted to visit Japan, from the exotic food and wild fashion in the cities to the nature and tradition in the smaller towns. I know there's going to be a ton to see and do. As a thank you for all of my hard detective work, P.G. Crowmeister has reserved a room for me at one of the area's best ryokans, or traditional inns. It'll be nice to finally take a break from solving mysteries and to spend a few weeks without danger and dark secrets hiding around every corner. I've already heard that the ryokan I'm staying in has quite a reputation. I'm not sure exactly for what, though. Well, I'll find that out soon. It's got some ghosties. <laughs> Join me in my next adventure, Shadow at the Water's Edge. I hear people talk about that one all the time. So I feel like I've been looking forward to that one for a long time. Yeah. Uh, I can't believe it's next. I thought it was one of the newer ones, but then I forget that we've done so many. We have done many, 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 many. <laughs> I think we're on like number 21 or 22 at this point. So yeah, well, cool. I'm excited to play that one. Um, apparently there's a really fun puzzle in that one that people on the subreddit, on the Nancy subreddit, were talking about how they have like a save in that game that they can load up just to play one of the mini games. <laughs> It's the bento box one. I don't know how it works or anything, but I just see people talking about the bento box game all the time. Wow. So. Fun, fun, fun. All right. Well. Um, maybe. I don't remember. Let's see. Uh, no, we don't need to yeah, see. It was what? Secrets to kill. We re released it in August 2010. Oh, okay. Yeah, August 2010. Yeah, because we. Trail of the Twister, June 2010, and October 2010. So. Yeah, Secrets Can Kill. Is technically next. Which is a bummer because we just got excited. About yeah, it. that's okay. <laughs> that still means that it, we get to play it in like two weeks. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. But yeah, we don't have many left. We're getting close to the end, you guys. We have, I don't know, maybe like 10 ish left to play. I have quite a lineup of <laughs> detective-y, puzzle-y, <laughs> mystery games for us to play. Um, so I think we'll be okay. But I am going to be sad when we finish playing Nancy. <laughs> for sure. Well, this was such a fun stream. Thank you, everybody, for the raids. I appreciate it so much. So it was like... Um, it was, who who rated tonight? Well, Heartless Sign hosted us. 
and then Malexinator rated and Ice Cold Car rated. Um, and then let's see, let me expand this a little bit. Grace Geist, AG Biz, and uh, let's see, Lacey and Graham. Thank you guys so much for the follows. And um, Lauren and I will see you guys next time we play a Nancy game, which should be probably this weekend sometime, I would guess. Um, so yeah, we'll see you then for Secrets Can Kill. We're going to play that one next. Um, yeah, goodbye. I'm going to check actually and see if we can raid another Nancy player just to see. Anybody else? All right, let's search on the old. Nancy Drew. Somebody's playing Curse of Blackmore Manor. Like that scene you often play blind. Yeah, I think it's a, a fan favorite for sure. All right, yeah, we're going to do a little raid and go say hi to somebody playing Curse of Blackmore Manor. So I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much. Have a great night, everybody. Mm-hmm. <clears throat>